Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to create, snowfall in After Effects, so without any wait, let's see the preview. To create this snowfall, you need to install Trap Code plugin, you can purchase it from the link given in the description. You can also try its trial version. Here I am using the latest version of Trap Code 15.1. So without any wait, let's start creating snowfall. Create a new composition. Here I will name it as Snowfall. As usual set width and height to 1920 by 1080 pixels. Make sure frame rate is set to 30 frames per second. Here we will set time duration to 10 seconds. Perfect. Now we need to create a solid layer. Name it as snow, this layer will be our snowfall layer. Now in effects. From RG Trap Code, select Particular. You can see the default particles. Now in Emitter. Here you can increase or decrease the number of particles, depending how dense snowfall you want. Here I will set it to near about 190. You can change this value anytime you want. Change emitter type to, box. Perfect. Change position subframe, to 10x smooth. Change direction to bidirectional. Here you can see particle type is sphere. Now we will make changes to this particles. In particles. Change particle type to cloud let. Let's change particle size to 3. Let's adjust the opacity for particles. Let's set it to near about 16%. Let's increase the particle life. Set it to near about 32. Now in physics. Let's set gravity to 50. You can see, our snow has started falling. Now in air. Let's set air resistant to 0.3. Here we need to adjust wind Y and wind Z. Slightly adjust the values. In turbulent field, adjust the after position value. Perfect. Physics part is over. In emitter size, we will change emitter value to x, y, z individually. Let's increase the emitter size x value, increase it till it cover the screen. Set emitter size y to 0. Change emitter size Z value. Now we need to decrease the position value for Y axis, decrease it as shown. You can see the preview. Let's 
Let's set velocity to 50, to control the speed of particles. Set velocity distribution to 0. At start of the frame there is now snowfall. To display snowfall from start. In emission extras. Increase the pre-run value. Perfect. Now you can see continuous snowfall. In particles, if you want, you can increase or decrease the number of snow particles. Here you are free to make changes in any setting to get some random snow effect. To adjust the particle positions in 3D dimension. Let's create a new camera layer. Now for camera press P to bring up position. Now you can increase the position value for Z axis, as shown. Perfect. If you want to blow the particles, then, for snow layer. In effects and preset. Search for CC force motion blur. Add it to solid layer. Change blur value to 20. Perfect. Now let's import the footage. Here I am going to use this footage. Add it to the timeline. Now we will adjust the snow color to match the snow in this footage. In particular, in particle, here you can select the color from the footage. Perfect. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our snowfall is created. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial. If you like this tutorial, then make sure to like and share this video, and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you.